Hello, this is Elena Angel, and I'm going to be showing you how to do eight different tricks. So the first trick is to get in the arena. This one's not that hard. So you're just going to take your horse and go in the back of the arena. Okay, and so now you're going to go to this, these bleachers, and you're going to like put your horse like right up at it to where it's like the front half is like in it, and then dismount, and then whistle. So now you should see that your horse is below you, which is what that green triangle is, and then you're just going to mount. And then as you see up here, you're like you're like underground, which is so funny. It's a good hiding place. And so you're just gonna go like in this way. And then now you're in the arena. So this one most people know and it's so easy. So and to get out you just hit the stable button. And now on to the paddock. A lot of people get VIP just so they can hop into the paddock so easy, you know. But I don't think getting VIP is worth it. I mean, it does have a lot of stable hands and cool stuff, but I like to earn everything. So, you're just going to put your horse right up against this fence on, your, on the horse's right side, and then you're going to get off. So you should have your horse, like, right up against it as close as you can. And it does not work the other direction. You have to be on the right side of your horse. Then you're just going to pet. Okay, so I wasn't close enough. Okay, so what you have to do is get really close to this fence. Maybe that'll work. Then get off. And pet there. Then you should just like pop in. But then now your horse is not, so you're gonna have to go do something at, out of here. I'm gonna do this first one, which is only 75 coins. Now, right after you spend the coins, you don't have to like run the whole thing because it goes through the manual and everything. You can just hit the X and you'll be in. This is the only glitch that costs money to do, but you can choose how much to spend, which is obviously the best to spend 75, because that's super easy to get. And now, onto the dressage arena. You have to be level 7 or up to do this one, or VIP. So let's move over to the dressage arena. Okay, so as you can see, you go to go in and it's like it stops you from going in. You're just going to go all the way around to the back. Some people figure out how to do it on the side, but it, that never works for me. Like some people do it here, but it just don't work. So I just take a few more steps to go behind to make sure that it works. So right here in the middle of the back, you're going to put your horse, just like the other arena, as close as close as you can to it, like this. Then you're going to get off. Now leave your horse here. You're going to walk all the way around back to the front. And this will be the tricky part to like, because you're gonna have to call your horse when you get to the front. But you have to face a certain way for it to work. A lot of people don't understand that, and they call and their horse doesn't come the right way. 
So you are going to go like this. And you're going to get, like, see how I'm walking all the way up to it? And then you're just going to go like that. That way you're all the way up against it and facing that way. Then you're going to call. Hang on, my best friend is... On. YouTubing. And then you see? Then your horse is now in the arena, and then you just mount. Now you're in. And there's another glitch. Um, so just dismount. This one you can do anywhere, it doesn't have to be in an arena. And then you're going to go far from your horse. Then you're going to hit mount. And then hit rest. And that, now your horse is laying down as you are riding. It's so funny though. And you can just, you can still do things with the horse, like make him stand up. Okay, so now we're going to be doing another glitch. And this one is how to get out of the border fence, which is that fence right over there. So you're just going to go up to it. And you're going to stand right in here and face this way. And then dismount. You can just call your horse now, but it'll take the long way, which is like a whole minute. Or you can just stand like right in your horse and then call. And then it'll just pop up right next to the fence. So that's how you get in or get out of the border. And there's the castle up ahead, but you can't go too far because... There's a border there, unless you're like level 25 or VIP. Okay, so our next glitch. This contains something to mine. So let's go find something to mine. There it is. So you're gonna you're gonna go and you're gonna stand right in front of it, like this, with the horse's tail at what you're mining. And then you're just gonna go to mine it. Okay, hang on. Alright. Then just start mining, and then click the green. And mount. The game is so glitchy. There. Then you'll be standing on your horse. And you'll be sitting on it backwards. So glitchy. Okay. It's so funny. You're like sitting backwards. I did that and someone asked me, well, you know you're sitting backwards, right? <laughs> and it also works sideways, too. You just... Hang on, I got off. It works any direction. You just put your horse sideways. It doesn't have to be next to what you're mining. It can be pretty far away. That girl's in my way. Okay, I'll just do it on this direction. Okay, so you're sideways and then you hit mount, and your girl will automatically change direction to face what you're mining, so that's why you can do any direction. Then now you're sideways. This is like another goofy glitch. I actually found this one myself. The other one's friends taught me, but this one I found myself. And I think there's one more glitch, but it's really hard, so... Oh wait, there's another one. So this glitch is also in the dressage arena. It's not like a huge glitch that you would just go do, but... Just in case you wanted to, I'm going to show it to you. 
I think it's a good glitch to know so that way you can like when you're playing hide and seek with someone you can like hide there and they'll like never find you but you have to be careful in this glitch or you'll mess up and be like really glitchy so just stand like here and you're gonna go up and you're gonna like stand just like that to where you're like right at this wall and then dismount and call and your horses below the stairs and then mount. Then you want to be careful not to step into that green area down there. So I carefully turn. And what's funny is they can't see you. They can't see your name. This is like walking a tightrope. You gotta be careful not to fall. And if you, I'll, I'll show you what happens when you do fall. Okay, hang on. All right, that's what happens when you fall. It's like you're falling away from it, and you, you can still like run around, but it's like you can't get back unless you hit the home button. And then there's one more glitch, which is really hard it's really hard and tricky so okay so you're just gonna go back out of this border and this this trick um, I have no idea how someone found it but my friend taught me it. It's to get in the fantasy arena. So this is really hard. So you're just gonna tap your horse and get this ready to hit dismount. So you're just gonna like run and run until you hit this border, then dismount and keep running. And when it works, you should be in there jumping. It's like you're going way up in the air. It's like so funny. It's fun to just do that. So this is the last glitch. Some people call them glitches, some people call them tricks. I, I call them both. So. Just never give up, keep trying. I mean, look, I, I mean, I'm still working on it. You can stop the video now. This is all I'm gonna do is just go into the fantasy arena. But this is gonna take probably a little while. It takes like 10 tries, maybe more. Sometimes it helps to get a running start. And the reason you call your horse when you go to mount is because it says that your obstacle, there's an obstacle blocking the way when you're near that border thing. So I thought I'd make a video on this trick because it's very hard to explain to somebody by typing. Although a girl did do it, but it's really, really hard for me. So it's better to just like show in a video. Like I said, it's hard. It's hard to do, but it's easy. It's like easy instructions. I don't know why it does that. You go into the ground like that. 
Okay, so let's try it again. Okay, so this is really hard. There we go, finally. Finally did it. Okay, so that took like four minutes, maybe two or three. Man. So, I, okay, so you can see that you are literally bouncing around. You can also go and explore, but you don't want to come back out because you'll have to do a whole thing again. So just call your horse as you walk this way, or as I should say, bounce this way. So you're just going to like, you, you cannot mount your horse while you're bouncing, and you cannot mount when you're not in the arena. It's so beautiful, I can't wait till I'm level 25. Five levels away though. So you ha the only place you can mount is right here on the stairs, so just wait for your horse to come up here. And then you can mount. But there's one sad thing about this. You cannot explore anywhere else. It's like, it's like, you know, right there. It's like there's just like a border that goes all the way back, all the way down. So, you're stuck in here until you hit the home button. Or stable button. But I'm just going to show you this. Look how pretty it is. There's that castle way up ahead up there. It's just so pretty. I can't wait to be able to to show in here. It's very big too. Well, th those are all the glitches that I know so far. I will make another video if I find more. So thank you for watching this. Hope these have helped you learn how to do them. And please subscribe because I have no subscribers yet. Um, and thank you for watching. Have a good day.